Hello, welcome to Arvind Singh Academy. Today we are going to discuss probability. Uh, this is a, a lecture, first lecture, introductory lecture in which we will discuss about the probability and the different aspects of probability, why we read the probability and all about the probability. So first of all, what is meaning of the probability? Literal sense of probability is what? Literal sense that is the meaning of probability that I am going to discuss and thereafter uh, we will discuss uh, about the different type of aspects of probability. So what is probability? Probability is what? The literal sense of probability, usually in discussion we are saying that the probability is something, there is a probability of that this will happen, probability that he will come, there is a probability that he will pass. What is this probability? Probability is nothing else but chance of happening of an event. Chance of happening of an event. Probability is chance of happening of an event of an event. So what is an event? Now the question is what is an event? What is event? Will you tell me what is event? Event is anything that happens, anything that occurs, that is called an event. Anything that occurs, that occurs, occurs, called an event called an event. Anything that occurs is called an event. For example, if I throw a coin, this is an event. If I throw a dice, this is also an event. If I draw a card out of a well supported pack of 52 card, this is also an event. Anything, what you say, that is an event. I am speaking, this is also an event. The possibility is either you will understand it or you will not understand it. These are the two outcomes. These are the two possibilities. So anything that can happen in this world, that is considered to be an event. And the outcomes of that event, maybe 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, there are several outcomes. Maybe only one outcomes or in case, maybe more than one outcomes. But definitely there will be outcomes. One and only on one outcome that is also possible. And if there are more than one outcome that is also possible. For example, when I draw a ball from a bag containing only red balls. Right now? I am drawing red balls. The only one possibility that anything we draw that will be red. Only one outcome. One ball in bag, one red ball. You draw a ball, what is the probability that it will be red? This is 100%. Surely it will be red because there is only one outcome. One ball is kept, only one outcome is there. That it will be red ball. Similarly, more than one outcomes are possible. If there are two red balls, then again red ball will come. But there are two possibilities. Which red ball will come? First red ball or second red ball? Big red ball or small red ball? So there are certain outcomes. Any event has certain possibilities. When a coin is tossed, there are two possibilities. Either head will come there or tail will come. So these possibilities that are called outcomes. What will come out of the event? What will come out of the event that is called outcomes. So outcomes, after the event, what will come? That is called outcomes. And set of all outcomes are called sample space. So one term is there, that is called sample space. Sample space. Sample space. The set of all outcomes, outcomes of an event is called sample space. The same of set of all outcomes of an event is called sample space. For example, when a coin is tossed, coin is tossed, the outcomes are head 
or tail. If head is denoted by H and tail is denoted by T, then outcome set can be represented as H and T. You know well, set can be represented in curly brackets. The members of elements of set can be represented in curly brackets. So this is a set of all outcomes, possible outcomes, and that is described as S. S stands for simple space. Similarly, NS, what is the meaning of NS? NS is number of elements, number of elements in sample space. Sample space. Number of elements in sample space, that is NS. N stands for number of elements in simple space. How many elements are there? Two. So number of elements in simple space are two. Similarly, if I can take another example, an example is when a dice is thrown, dice is thrown, the outcomes are, outcomes are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, any one of out 6 may come out and therefore simple space includes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And number of elements in that simple space is 6. Because there are 6 possible outcomes. When a dice is thrown, then there are 6 possible outcomes. That is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, or 6. So ns denotes 6. Now, the number of elements in simple space much depend upon the event. Event is what? Then accordingly, the simple space can be described. Instead of one coin, if I throw two coins together, if I toss two coins together, then the outcomes would be either or one coin toss two times. Think about that. What is the possible outcome? I toss a coin once and then again I toss a coins again. So in first throw, there may be possible that head come. In second throw, second toss, again maybe head come. First time head and second time tail may come. First time tail, second time head may come. And first time tail, second time tail may come. So these are the four possible set of pairs of event, set of pairs of possibilities, set of pairs of outcomes that are possible after throwing a coin two times. So in that case, simple space would be 1 SS, HH, SHS, HT, TH and TT. Number of elements in simple space would be 4. Similarly, if in one throw of dice, one toss of dice, one toss of coin, sorry, one toss of coin, simple space has only two outcome. Number of outcome in simple space are two. If two coins are tossed together, number of outcomes are four. Suppose similarly, if three coins are tossed together, or one coin is tossed twice, H, H, H may come. First two times head and then tail may come. Head, tail, head may come. Tail, head, head may come. And two times tail, one times head may come. And tail, head, tail may come. And head, tail, tail may come. Or all three times tail may come. This is a common thinking in which one can think. So when one coin is tossed three times, the outcomes can be all three times may head come, head may appear all three times. First time I toss a coin and head may come. Second time again I toss a coin, head may come. Third time again I toss a coin, head may come. This is possibility. Possibility? It may be possible. Right? Similarly, in the second case, First two times head may come and the third chance tail may come. Head, tail, head, tail, head, head means first time tail and last two times head may come. Two tail, first two times tail and last time head may come. Tail, head, tail may come or head, tail, tail may come or it is also possible that all three times together tail only tail, first time tail, second time tail, third time tail may come. So all three times tail may come. So number of element in that case, simple space has 8 only. So, it is very difficult to enlarge that one coin when tossed, two outcomes are there. Two coin tossed together, four outcomes are there. Three coin tossed together, then a 
different outcomes are there, we want to find an analogy so that we can find a specific formula so that we can find the number of outcomes when a number of points cross together. So, after doing this, we find that 2 to the power 1, 4 is nothing else but 2 to the power 2, 8 is nothing else but 2 to the power 3, 1 coin toss, then outcomes are 2 to the power 1, 2 coin toss, then outcome will be 2 to the power 2, 3 coin toss, then outcomes is 2 to the power 3, so we come to know that if there are 4 coin toss, what will be outcome? 2 to the power 4 and therefore on the basis of this we are able to write a formula that write down when a coin is tossed n times when a coin is tossed n times or n coin are tossed together when a coin is tossed n times or n coin are tossed together tossed together the total number of outcomes number of outcomes in simple space in simple space will be 2 raised to the power n. 3 coin then 2 raised to the power 3, n coin then 3 raised to 2 to the raised to the power n. 2 coin then 2 to the power 2, 3 coin 2 to the power 3 and on the same pattern we come to know that if there are n coins then total outcomes will be 2 raised to the power n. Okay? So proceed to another one another similar type of event right and um, what is that as we have discussed with the definition that when a coin is tossed once times once then two outcomes are there when a dice is thrown then six outcomes are there one dice is thrown then one two three four five six these are the six outcomes that is ns is equal to six if two dice are thrown, outcomes, what are the outcomes? Can be 1-1 one, one on both the dice, can be 1-1. One, one. Or one dice thrown twice, first time 1, second time 1. It is also possible first time 1, second time 2, first time 1, second time 3, 1-4, one, 1-5 one, and 1-6 one, may come. Similarly, 2-1, 2-2, 2-3, 2-4, 2-5, 2-6, 2-7, 2-8, 2-9, 2-10, 2-11, 2-12, 2-13, 2-14, 2-15, 2-16, 2-17, 2-18, 2-19, 2-20, 2-21, 2-22, 2-23, 2-24, 2-25, 2-26, 2-27, 2-28, 2-29, 2-30, 2-31, 2-32, 2-33, 2-34, 2-35, 2-36, 2-37, 2-38, 2-39, 2-40, 2-41, 2-42, 2-43, 2-44, 2-45, 2-46, 2-47, 2-48, 2-49, 2-50, 2-51, 2-52, 2-53, 2-54, 2-55, 2-56, 2-57, 2-58, 2-59, 2-60, 2-61, 2-62, 2-63, 2-64, 2-65, 2-66, 2-67, 2-68, 2-69, 2-70, 2-71, 2-72, 2-73, 2-74, 2-75, 2-76, 2-77, 2-78, 2-79, 2-80, 2-81, 2-82, 2-83, 2-84, 2-85, 2-86, 2-87, 2-88, 2-89, 2-90, 2-91, 2-92, 2-93, 2-94, 2-95, 2-96, 2-97, 2-98, 2-99, 2-100, 2-101, 2-102, 2-103, 2-104, 2-105, 2-106, 2-107, 2-108, 2-109, 2-110, 2-111, 2-112, 2-113, 2-114, 2-115, 2-116, 2-117, 2-118, 2-119, 2-120, 2-121, 2-122, 2-123, 2-124, 2-125, 2-126, 2-127, 2-128, 2-129, 2-130, 2-131, 2-132, 2-133, 2-134, 2-135, 2-136, 2-137, 2-138, 2-139, 2-140, 2-141, 2-142, 2-143, 2-144, 2-145, 2-146, 2-147, 2-148, 2-149, 2-150, 2-151, 2-152, 2-153, 2-154, 2-155, 2-156, 2-157, 2-158, 2-159, 2-160, 2-170, 2-171, 2-172, 2-173, 2-174, 2-175, 2-176, 2-177, 2-178, 2-179, 2-180, 2-181, 2-182, 2-183, 2-184, 2-185, 2-186, 2-187, 2-188, 2-189, 2-190, 2-191, 2-192, 2-193, 2-194, 2-195, 2-196, 2-197, 2-198, 2-199, 2-200, 2-201, 2-203, 2-204, 2-205, 2-206, 2-207, 2-208, 2-209, 2-210, 2-211, 2-212, 2-213, 2-214, 2-215, 2-216, 2-217, 2-218, 2-219, 2-220, 2-221, 2-222, 2-223, 2-224, 2-225, 2-226, 2-227, 2-228, 2-29, 2-30, 2-31, 2-32, 2-33, 2-34, 2-35, 2-36, 2-37, 2-38, 2-39, 2-40, 2-41, 2-42, 2-43, 2-44, 2-45, 2-46, 2-47, 2-48, 2-49, 2-50, 2-51, 2-52, 2-53, 2-54, 2-55, 2-56, 2-57, 2-58, 2-59, 2-60, 2-61, 2-62, 2-63, 2-64, 2-65, 2-66, 2-67, 2-68, 2-69, 2-70, 2-71, 2-72, 2-73, 2-74, 2-75, 2-76, 2-77, 2-78, 2-79, 2-80, 2-81, 2-82, 2-83, 2-84, 2-85, 2-86, 2-87, 2-88, 2-89, 2-90, 2-91, 2-92, 2-93, 2-94, 2-95, 2-96, 2-97, 2-98, 2-99, 2-100, 2-101, 2-102, 2-103, 2-104, 2-105, 2-106, 2-107, 2-108, 2-109, 2-110, 2-111, 2-112, 2-113, 2-114, 2-115, 2-116, 2-117, 2-118, 2-119, 2-120, 2-121, 2-122, 2-123, 2-124, 2-125, 2-126, 2-127, 2-128, 2-129, 2-130, 2-131, 2-132, 2-133, 2-134, 2-135, 2-136, 2-137, 2-138, 2-139, 2-140, 2-141, 2-142, 2-143, 2-144, 2-145, 2-146, 2-147, 2-148, 2-149, 2-150, 2-151, 2-152, 2-153, 2-154, 2-155, 2-156, 2-157, 2-158, 2-159, 2-160, 2-170, 2-171, 2-172, 2-173, 2-174, 2-175, 2-176, 2-177, 2-178, 2-179, 2-180, 2-181, 2-182, 2-183, 2-184, 2-185, 2-186, 2-187, 2-188, 2-189, 2-190, 2-191, 2-192, 2-193, 2-194, 2-195, 2-196, 2-197, 2-198, 2-199, 2-200, 2-201, 2-203, 2-204, 2-205, 2-206, 2-207, 2-208, 2-209, 2-210, 2-211, 2-212, 2-213, 2-214, 2-215, 2-216, 2-217, 2-218, 2-219, 2-220, 2-221, 2-222, 2-223, 2-224, 2-225, 2-226, 2-227, 2-228, 2-29, 2-30, 2-31, 2-32, 2-33, 2-34, 2-35, 2-36, 2-37, 2-38, 2-39, 2-40, 2-41, 2-42, 2-43, 2-44, 2-45, 2-46, 2-47, 2-48, 2-49, 2-50, 2-51, 2-52, 2-53, 2-54, 2-55, 2-56, 2-57, 2-58, 2-59, 2-60, 2-61, 2-62, 2-63, 2-64, 2-65, 2-66, 2-67, 2-68, 2-69, 2-70, 2-71, 2-72, 2-73, 2-74, 2-75, 2-76, 2-77, 2-78, 2-79, 2-80, 2-81, 2-82, 2-83, 2-84, 2-85, 2-86, 2-87, 2-88, 2-89, 2-90, 2-91, 2-92, 2-93, 2-94, 2-95, 2-96, 2-97, 2-98, 2-99, 2-100, 2-101, 2-102, 2-103, 2-104, 2-105, 2-106, 2-107, 2-108, 2-109, 2-110, 2-111, 2-112, 2-113, 2-114, 2-115, 2-116, 2-117, 2-118, 2-119, 2-120, 2-121, 2-122, 2-123, 2-124, 2-125, 2-126, 2-127, 2-128, 2-129, 2-130, 2-131, 2-132, 2-133, 2-134, 2-135, 2-136, 2-137, 2-138, 2-139, 2-140, 2-141, 2-142, 2-143, 2-144, 2-145, 2-146, 2-147, 2-148, 2-149, 2-150, 2-151, 2-152, 2-153, 2-154, 2-155, 2-156, 2-157, 2-158, 2-159, 2-160, 2-170, 2-171, 2-172, 2-173, 2-174, 2-175, 2-176, 2-177, 2-178, 2-179, 2-180, 2-181, 2-182, 2-183, 2-184, 2-185, 2-186, 2-187, 2-188, 2-189, 2-190, 2-191, 2-192, 2-193, 2-194, 2-195, 2-196, 2-197, 2-198, 2-199, 2-200, 2-201, 2-203, 2-204, 2-205, 2-206, 2-207, 2-208, 2-209, 2-210, 2-211, 2-212, 2-213, 2-214, 2-215, 2-216, 2-217, 2-218, 2-219, 2-220, 2-221, 2-222, 2-223, 2-224, 2-225, 2-226, 2-227, 2-228, 2-29, 2-30, 2-31, 2-32, 2-33, 2-34, 2-35, 2-36, 2-37, 2-38, 2-39, 2-40, 2-41, 2-42, 2-43, 2-44, 2-45, 2-46, 2-47, 2-48, 2-49, 2-50, 2-51, 2-52, 2-53, 2-54, 2-55, 2-56, 2-57, 2-58, 2-59, 2-60, 2-61, 2-62, 2-63, 2-64, 2-65, 2-66, 2-67, 2-68, 2-69, 2-70, 2-71, 2-72, 2-73, 2-74, 2-75, 2-76, 2-77, 2-78, 2-79, 2-80, 2-81, 2-82, 2-83, 2-84, 2-85, 2-86, 2-87, 2-88, 2-89, 2-90, 2-91, 2-92, 2-93, 2-94, 2-95, 2-96, 2-97, 2-98, 2-99, 2-100, 2-101, 2-102, 2-103, 2-104, 2-105, 2-106, 2-107, 2-108, 2-109, 2-110, 2-111, 2-112, 2-113, 2-114, 2-115, 2-116, 2-117, 2-118, 2-119, 2-120, 2-121, 2-122, 2-123, 2-124
possible. Again we come to the conclusion that if a dice is thrown n times or n dice are thrown together, the total number of outcome will be 6 raised to the power n. Right? So we can do that and write down this. When a dice when a dice is thrown when a dice is thrown n times or n dice are thrown together thrown together the total number of outcome outcomes in simple space simple space is 2 raised to the power equal to 2 raised to the power 6 raised to the power n then again we come to the conclusion you have a coin then there is a head one side and another side there is a tail right now there is a tail so there are two faces of coin and therefore 2 raised to the power n and dice has 6 faces so therefore there will be 6 raised to the power n we come to a conclusion 1 phase, 2 phase, 3 phase, 4 phase and this is inside 5 and this one is 6 so 6 faces are there and therefore 6 raised to the power n will be answered so if anything that has 3 faces only then 3 to the power n anything that has 4 faces only Four possibility, four to the power n. So this is what the total number of outcomes in simple space. But whatever all outcomes are there, all of them may not be favorable. Maybe some of them are favorable, maybe none of them are favorable, or maybe few of them are favorable. You have visited to a particular shop to purchase anything, suppose dress, and shopkeeper has shown you five, six dresses. May be possible that none of them you like it. None of them are favorable for you. You don't like any one of them. That is possible. So minimum selection can be, minimum favorable item can be zero. In case you don't like any one of them, it is number of favorable item is zero in that sort. Sometimes it happens that all of them look so beautiful, attractive, that you're not able to decide which one I should pick up. In that case, all of them are favorable. So maximum all can be favorable. Minimum zero can be favorable. But it cannot be negative under any circumstances. It is not possible that shopkeeper has shown you five dresses and you think, say, minus two of them I don't like. This is not possible. If five of dresses they have shown and you don't say that Usually, that I like 10 of them. You have shown 5 to me, but I like 10 of them. How that is possible? That is not possible. So, minimum number of favorable item can be 0. Maximum can be all. So, number of favorable item is what? Favorable outcomes. Out of all simple space, out of all outcomes in simple space, some of them may be favorable. So the set of those outcomes called favorable outcomes. Favorable outcome and it is denoted by F. So let me write this. Favorable outcomes. What is that? Favorable outcomes. Outcomes. That is F represented by F. The set of all all favorable outcomes favorable outcomes that is also described as favorable events. Yes. The set of all those favorable outcomes outcomes out of simple space out of sample space is called favorable event. Set is called favorable events. 
फेवरेबल इवेंट्स एंड इट इज डिनोटेड बाय एफ इट इज डिनोटेड बाय बाय एफ एम एफ डिनोट नंबर ऑफ फेवरेबल आउटकम्स नंबर ऑफ फेवरेबल आउटकम्स एन एफ डिनोट नंबर ऑफ फेवरेबल आउटकम्स एंड देर फोर एन एफ इज अलवेज लेस देन और ग्रेटर वन एंड ग्रेटर देन इक्वल टू जीरो बिकॉज वी वॉन्ट टू फाइंड इट एन एफ इज अलवेज लेस ग्रेटर देन जीरो एंड लेस देन एन एस because we have to select out of ns it cannot be more than ns it cannot be more than the elements in simple space so it will be like in between ns and zero minimum favorable items can be zero maximum can be on all so nf lies between zero to ns i hope you got it right huh? so now for example if A dice is thrown. Then what is the simplest space? One, two, three, four, five, six. And you want that either four will come or six will come. So your favorable is four or six out of them. So although number of elements in simplest space six, but you like only two of them. In that case, your favorable items are only two. You don't want all them, but you want only two. Why you want two? Because of the circum. Concept because of the different requirement, you want only two or four or four or six. So only two of them are available. All of you have been played a snake and ladder in your childhood, right now? A snake and ladder. And what you are thinking that if you whenever your turn comes and you throw a dice, you want if four will come, I get ladder, right now? So four is available in that time. You want four only. If four will come, I will get ladder. And whenever some opponent person throw the dice, what do you want? If two will come, so let let two will come. Then a snake will bite him and he will come down. So like this. So sometimes depending upon the requirement and circumstances, some of them may be favorable and some of them may may not be favorable. So two of them are favorable out of six. The relation between these two is described for probability of an event. So what is probability of an event? Let me write probability of an event. The definition. Probability of an event is defined as note down. Probability of an event is defined as. probability of an event is defined as the ratio of number of favorable even event to the total number of event total number of an event total number of events probability of an event is defined as the number of favorable event to the total number of events it is denoted by pe it is denoted by pe E E means stand for probability of an event. So probability of an event is number of favorable event, favorable event to the total number of event, total number of event. That is N F by N S, N F by N S. So P is N F by N S. Probability of an event is N F by N S. You understand it? Probability of event is N F by N S. 
you know, NF is number of favorable outcome is less than, greater than 0 and less than NS. If I would divide both the side by NS, 0 by NS, NF by NS, and NS by NS, I have divided both the side by NS. Divide by NS both the sides. Divide by NS both the sides. So what will come? 0 by something is 0. And NF by NS is as per definition we can write probability of an event. And NS divided by NS is 1. So probability of an event lies between 0 to 1. Probability of an event lies between 0 to 1. It cannot be less than 0 and it cannot be more than 1. One cannot say I have minus 5 probability to pass in this examination. Anybody cannot have probability negative. So probability cannot be negative. That is always greater than or equal to 0 and less than or equal to 1. 1 means what? Total probability is 1. 1 means 100%, you know. So 100% probability can be to pass in examination. If you have written well, you have answered all the questions, then what do you say? Whenever you come back and your mom asks what number you will get, you are saying 100% number I will get. But you cannot say, out of 100 I will get 200 mom. No, this is not possible. More than 100, out of 100 is not possible. So probability cannot be more than 1. If anyone is saying that 110% sure that this will happen, doesn't mean he is intelligent. It means he is not aware about the fact of probability, he don't know anything about the probability, and he has no idea about the probability. Probability cannot be more than 100%. It will be always less than or equal to 100%. What will be happen? When probability of an event is 0, then what you say? In that case, this is called null event. Null event. When probability of an event is 0, it is called null event. Right? And when probability of an event is 1, then it is called sure event. Sure event. Sure event. Means this will 100% happen. And probability of event is 0, then it is called null event. For example, let me write one example for every type. Null event and sure event. Suppose a bag is there and there is only red balls. Red balls are there and one ball is drawn and someone asks what is the probability that it would be red? Sure, 100%. Here are 10 balls kept in the bag and any one of them can be drawn. So total outcomes can be 10. 10 different type of events can happen. 10 different possibilities can happen and all of them are, you want only red balls, so all of them are favorable and therefore probability in that case will be 10 out of 10, that is 1. 100% sure that out of red ball, if any ball can be drawn, that will be definitely red ball. Right? Similarly, uh, the second one, if one has to find black ball, what is the probability? 0 by 10, that is 0. Because out of red ball, you cannot withdraw black ball. Got it? So this is all about the basic concept of probability. I hope you got it. Okay.